The 2022 Husky Dog Pound competition at Bloomsburg University kicked off this morning. It's a huge business focused competition that draws hundreds of students and this year it's back. 2822 Eyewitness News reporter Thomas Battle has the story. This competition doesn't have a lot to do with dogs, but everything to do with inspiring students to get creative and maybe even win some cash prizes. It's not just about the money. It's about getting your product out there, getting your ideas out there. And it's, it's very great. I love this program. It started four years ago and now includes 60 school districts with 600 students gathering to share their innovative ideas. Each team gets three minutes to pitch their idea to the judges, followed by Q&A. We wanted to uh, motivate students to become entrepreneurs and we wanted to um, recognize innovation. So we kind of took our competition off the actual Shark Tank on TV. The top 30 teams will walk out with cash prizes, with first place going home with $1,000. So we encourage products. Um, a lot of students also do applications. We have some nonprofit ideas, and we also have some local homegrown ideas like coffee shops and bakeries. So it runs the gamut. Some of the innovations are incredibly practical and creative. Our main attraction to Shoelace, if you will, is we're going to have a flint tip and a steel tip, which would be able to make a spark. So you can cook like your, your food, keep warm, uh, purify some water. As you can imagine, students are working around the clock on products and pitches. Four to three months to actually like come up with the full plan out idea. Yeah. Adding they would absolutely do it again and hope to see more teams in the future. I think the best part is just being able to come out, make new friends and talk to people and just learning about entrepreneurship and business is really good for young students. In Bloomsburg, Columbia County, Thomas Battle 2822 Eyewitness News. And if you're interested in joining the competition next year, you can find more information on our website, pahomepage.com.